Loading, loading, strap got the lyrics like I'm bowling, bowling Pushing on, keep rolling, rolling Hello when I listen but I told him, told him One more time, your favourite MC's bronze or silver These raps here are golden, golden Cards on the table, there's no folding Spit bars at the club, zoning, zoning TikTok come to London, get ripped off Man get pissed off when I start lift off Sweet like flavours, cookie and biscuit Fronty, yeah, the bars I get rinsed off Picked up my song, yo, every time I tripped off Good morning and welcome back to the channel It's Tuesday the 1st of October and um, we'll, I'll take you through my day, full day of eating, that sort of stuff. I need to order some contact lenses, which I'm going to do now. Training with my boyfriend this morning. We're doing squats and bench press, I think. Yeah, squats and bench press. And I'll do a little bit of accessory work. And then for the rest of the day, just go to work. So I'll show you what I'm eating. Still doing calorie counting. Sad times. I did weigh myself this morning. I was 76.9 kilos, so my guess of being 77 kilos was on the dot. Hey! No! Moody pants! Come here! Come here! Why are you being moody pants for? Huh? Go to your bed. So yeah, my guess of being 76, 77 kilos is actually correct. So that means I have around 2 kilos to lose for the competition. Which is not so bad. I have like, how many weeks? Let's see. One, two, three weeks, three weeks. So hopefully I can, hey naughty, hopefully I can lose some weight. Because I'm not really enjoying this dieting. It's not, I'm not going to tell you any lies, but that's the truth. But if I want to do it in somewhat of a healthy way, I'm going to have to do it this way. So calorie counting it is. Anyway, I need to order some contact lenses, so I'll be back in a bit. I don't know if I said, but the, I just did my first check-in. Uh, my weight was 76.9 this morning, so that means that apparently I don't actually have to make any weight for this uh, charity competition because it's a it goes on Wilkes points, which basically is a formula that does like your weight versus the, the, the weight you are versus the weight you're lifting, and then it works out like how many points you get, and then like it establishes like um, whoever gets the most points that way wins, so it kind of goes more on body weight as opposed to uh, weight categories, but I still need to make my weight category for November. Um, so yeah, this is basically what I'm looking like. I, w I was thinking I was 77 kilos, which is about right. Um, so I'm just going to stick with the two and a half thousand calories for now and see how I feel with that. And excuse me, hey little naughty girl, this is not your bed, is it? This is not your bed. Go, go, Rosie. Go to your bed, please. Go now. I don't have... That's not your bed. Go. Don't make me say it another time. Go. Good girl. So, I'm doing 2,500 calories. I'll see like what my weight will do over the next few weeks. Um, how much weight I lose, etc. I'm going to start doing check-ins. I'm going to have to start weighing myself because obviously I need to see how I'm progressing. Anyway, my first meal, 70 grams of cream of rice, 30 grams of whey, 15 grams of almond butter. Um, we're going to train. And we're, what boys are we doing today? Squat mm -hmm. bench and deadlift. Yeah, we see which one we're going to push. Because mm. my back wasn't feeling right the other day. Yeah. So. Depending on your back. Yeah, this way is not very nice, is it? Mm? This way is not very nice, is it? So, I'll go eat this, and then we'll see you in the gym. Motherfucker, I've been modified, 45, fitting like a motor car. I ain't regular, feel like Jordan wearing 45. Traumatized, victimized, seen some of my dive. Knock you off a base with a bat when them niggas slide. Homicide, genocide, televised, emphasize, perpetuating war. Tell that nigga he gon' pick a side. Hood ties from hood lines, my nigga doing dope lines. I'm running to the cops, that's a bitch. Exercise, uh, don't run into the cops, that's the motto. I don't see it coming to an end like legato. Get chipped like cicado, send a wave through the hood, now I'm sounding like vibrato. 
Why you eat bread with avocado? We be trying to die shells before I land in our tomato. Singing all my sorrows on Apollo. I've been trying to pave the way, but they didn't tell me it was potos. Mm. America ain't dreaming if it's scheming when the birth of a nation came from black. black, 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 black. Uh. We all know it's black, black genius. Everybody love the culture, they be black by convenience. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, my killer. You talking way too much conscience. Speak about some girls or some money or some diamonds or something. I'm not telling you to rap, not to rap how you rap, but make something we can vibe to. Shouting like a real anthem. Shawty saw my wallet, now she think I think I answer. Whoa, telling me she wanted me to hammer. Trying to get saved, baby, I am not the answer. No, I can never trick, trick, trick. Let the bitch is my bitch with a kiss on my lips like, ah. Oh. I am not a pimp with a limp. I'm a man with a gift and I'm doing my shit like, ah. Oh. Tell them other nips, I'm the nip. I'm the man in the city and my bank account bigger and my body count bigger. That's without a doubt. I'm a hundred steps ahead. That's a lot of mouth. That's a lot of clout. What you all about? What your dollar mouth? You a boy stout. I'm a big dog. Tell the truth, I don't get charged to shoot. Sign a corny mother. Turn this shit off, bro. I can't rap how everybody else rap, bro. Everybody talking about hoe, cars, clothes, chains, and money. That shit corny as fuck, bro. Oh, God, I don't want to rap about that corny ass shit. Alright guys, so it's the next day. I had a really, really terrible training yesterday and it put me in a foul mood. I was in a foul mood anyway, like I doubt for no particular reason. I've been I've been feeling like like a little bit depressed, but not for no reason. But I think it's because of the changing of the seasons and the weather is very all, like all over like the weather is extreme here at the moment. So we've literally gone from 30 Celsius, 28 to 30 Celsius on Saturday. The next day it was raining and cold, and this morning I almost had to I'm having to wear now now my winter jacket and it was almost freezing. That's how cold it is now. So and it's kind of been like that for the last few weeks. And I do have um I do think I have a little bit of seasonal affective disorder, which a lot of people do have. Um but in general, just like I had Pretty crappy training over the weekend. I had crappy, crappy training yesterday, and it just put me in a really shit mood because maybe it's also because I started dieting and I've been kind of hungry. Um, but in general, I've just not felt like my training's just been shit. And I think it's because I'm really overdue to sit for a sports massage. It's been a month, which is why I'm going to get one today. Um, and I think whilst I'm in this preparation for the competition, I'm gonna have to just put a bit more emphasis on it and make sure that I do seal vessel twice a week uh twice uh, every every other week at least at least or at least once a week because my body just hurts like I'm training and everything hurts my recovery is crap to be fair I have cut back on my I have stopped taking growth hormone for like a few days now since like the end of last week so maybe that's why I've not had any collagen for like over two weeks now because I've run out and I'm waiting for my fucking delivery to come so it could be just the collagen as well that because I haven't taken it for a couple of weeks that that's also impacting me but everything hurts I'm just like not recovering very well um and it's not even like I'm pushing myself the hard with training but also with the cold like my, my joints do get achy because I'm getting older Anyway, so in the end yesterday, I just ended up being moody and tired and I, we both slept for like an hour and a half in the daytime, which is really abnormal for me. I don't usually sleep in the daytime unless I'm exhausted and I've been, I've been really tired, but not just a normal tiredness. It's been like an extreme fatigue. So I don't know if I'm like fighting off a virus. I know before when like the, 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 the Rona was going around, like I never got it, but um, I did have a period where I was just like extremely fatigued. And I'm just wondering if maybe something like that is going on now where I'm just like, I had a headache as well yesterday. Like, I just wasn't feeling good mentally and physically. And it just put me in a shit mood, which like doesn't help anything either. But it's very difficult to shift out of it. I kind of did towards the end, but um, I tracked all my food yesterday. So um, I will, I guess, instant that That was me. Sorry. <laughs> I'm, leaning, I'm, I'm leaning on my, on my, on my honk. My thingy. Anyway, I'll insert it here what I ate yesterday. So I just track all my food. I only ate around 2200 calories. Um, now I'm going to go and train in titanium because I need to go to see Vazel afterwards. Uh, might get some food shopping. I took a meal with me. I'm just here, ready. So I'm going to go there for training. We'll see Vazel after. I've got chiropractic and massage, which I really, really need. My ankle keeps fucking me up as well. Like, you know how the problem with it? I keep twisting it, and I think it's big. I'm gonna see if maybe I need to get something like a, a like a, a protective, like a sleeve for around my ankle that I need to wear for uh, a couple of weeks because it's just annoying. Because I'm not, I won't be surprised if just my fucked up ankle is actually impacting my whole back because everything's connected, right? If you need, if you if you have a bad ankle, you get a bad knee, you get a bad back. Everything's connected. 
So I'll see maybe if I need to get something, because um, there's a pharmacy here, maybe I can get like some sort of like like ankle sleeve that just holds it in place for when I'm training and when I'm um, when I'm walking a lot. Um, he's probably going to tell me to not train and not walk, but that's not an option, so I'm going to have to just work around it. And I definitely need to get that collagen again. Anyway, I need to go because I don't have as much battery and I do have to try and get all my training done within the next two hours and I have to try and do my cardio, which I didn't do yesterday either. But I did get in 13,000 steps, so... I just didn't do my post cardio, but I do want to do that today. So let's get going. Nah, mate. Oh, knock knock. Something real, something raw, not accidental. No, I'm sure you're not needed. Show you the door, but what's that? What's that? Yeah, are you sure? Yeah, that's a rental. Yeah, what I bought. Lying, lying, nothing in your core. Buying, buying, yeah, what for? But do what I need to. Always sure. Something real, something raw, not accidental. No, I'm sure you're not needed. Show you the door. What's that? What's that? Yeah, are you sure? Yeah, that's a rental. Yeah, what I bought. Lying, lying, nothing in your core. Buying, buying, yeah, what for? But do what I need to. Always sure. Boring, never been that. I get paid bro, just to relax. Yeah, more money now. Yeah, more tax. Suited it now, don't worry about that Boring, yeah, I've never been that I get paid ball just to relax Yeah, more money, but yeah, more tax But suited it now, don't worry about that Flexing, yeah, but your soul is empty Dripping in diamonds, plenty Dripping in vibes, got plenty Got the technique, yeah, like Jackie Ow, one little chop like pow One little hit like wow Living for the now, live for the sound Nice for the dollar, but I'm making a pound, yeah Worry about, worry about that No, I don't worry about that Worry about that, worry about, worry about that Like, no, I don't worry about that Something Worry about, worry about that No, I don't worry about that Worry about that Worry about, worry about that Like, no, I don't worry about that Something real, something raw Not accidental, no, I'm sure You're not needed, show you the door What's that, what's that, yeah, are you sure? Yeah, that's a rental, yeah, what a bore Lying, lying, nothing in the core Buying, buying, yeah, what for? Do what I need to, always, always, always sure Something real, something raw Not accidental, no, I'm sure You're not needed, show you the door What's that, what's that, yeah, are you sure? Yeah, that's a rental, yeah, what a bore Lying, lying, nothing in the core Buying, buying, yeah, what for, but do what I need to always show sure. oh, oh. Knocking in the door, knocking in it one time, knocking in the door Always, always, always sure Knocking in the door, one time, one time, knocking in the door Knock, knock Hello Something real, something raw Not accidental, no, I'm sure You're not needed, show you the door What's that, what's that, yeah, are you sure? Yeah, that's a rental, yeah, what a poor for Lying, lying, nothing in the core for Buying, buying, yeah, what you for Do what I need to always show So just come to the massage appointment. I won't take this camera because I don't have much battery left on it. Um, I'll film a little bit with my phone. I've got um, an oat bake that I made. Um, this will be in my upcoming recipe book that I'm definitely going to start making. It's got some dog hairs or cat hairs and pineapple. Uh, well, I'm definitely over Vlogmas. I'm going to start doing like a recipe book or recipes. But not necessarily film the full recipes but show you some of them. To create hype and then take pictures and then a girl a subscriber of mine that I've actually met here in Bulgaria they also live in Bulgaria she um, she's an editor so we're gonna work together to put like an ebook together which will be cool with it. so I could do like 30 days or 31 days 30 recipes to start and then I can build on it so okay the training was really good, actually. Surprisingly very good, considering the last... Sunday was shit. Yesterday was shit. Today was a very nice session. So we pushed a bit more with volume. Um, the next session is going to be speed, and then we have, like, the SBD day. It's nice, anyway, to have, like, a progressive training. So I'm just going to eat this quickly. There's an appointment. It's in, like, five minutes. But I have to eat beforehand. So I'm done with the massage and I'm pretty much stuck in traffic. It was so painful, you guys. I tried to film a little bit, but literally, no joke, I was this close to crying several times. That's, that's how painful it is. 
and I'm not too sure why it is so painful. I'm guessing it's just because I'm not taking anything at all. And maybe it's just like uh, the powerlifting training is uh, it's just a bit more, it's just harder on the body or something. Um, I've not been as good with my recovery work either to be fair. Like I haven't been doing uh, as much stretching because of some of the gyms where I'm training in. And additionally I've not been doing uh, as much cold plunge and sauna so I'm going to have to really start doing that and do more foam rolling because... I can't have a massage like this again. It was also a month last time I had a last time I saw him. So anyway, my uh, my boyfriend sent me lots of cute pictures of him cuddling the good dogs, and he's about to walk him. Uh, my 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 uh, therapist told me uh, Vasil told me to take two thousand milligrams of magnesium for a couple of weeks and see how that goes. So I cannot explain the amount of pain I was in. So anyway. When I get back, I'm not sure how much more filming I'll do. I might get, pick it up tomorrow for the simple reason that I'm going to need to use this memory card to transfer files because I need to edit the vlog. I don't have time to sit down and film a reaction. And frankly, I don't really want to get on camera because I'm, I've, I look like shit from having forced my face into a, a like um, the massage table for two hours straight. And I'm kind of just in pain. And if I need to sleep, I kind of want to sleep because it was quite an intense training. And on top of that, the massage was really painful. Like it. When he finished, he was doing some really deep tissue work in my neck, which was super painful, like legit painful as fuck. After he did that, I stood up because I needed to go for a pee desperately. I've been laying there for like already an hour and a half. And no joke, I stood up and I almost fainted. I almost fainted. That's never happened to me. I, f I stood up, but I needed a second just to compose myself before I got up fully. And like, I, was, I just felt like I was on drugs or drunk, like everything was just like, everything was swirling and lightheaded and I've never had that before, so this is probably, I'm going to say one of the most painful massages I've ever had, I think. So I need to just go to the shop now to Lidl to get a few bits that uh, my boyfriend went to get some shopping yesterday but they didn't have everything I wanted. I need to go and get a couple of things, I might get something to, something yummy to eat that can kind of work into my macros because I just kind of fancy it. And after the pain I've been in, I feel like I need something to recover. And maybe something nice will help me feel a little bit better. <laughs> uh, I probably won't, but still, I just want to feel something nice. I guess the good thing about calorie counting is that, right? Um, I also did 10 minutes of cardio post-workout. I did get to the 20. That means that tonight, Dazer gets to, gets to go for another big walk again. Oh my god, it's taking fucking forever to go through here. Ah. Uh, Oh God, it's back to school and back to work. Sofia is such a weird city, right? In the summer, it's like a ghost town. And you can never get through the center really quickly. This is not the center, this is a student town. It's like an area next to where I live, uh, which is, there's a couple of universities here. But in the winter, it's, uh, in the summer, it's really easy to navigate. But in the winter, it takes fucking forever because there's like traffic lights everywhere. And what they do in Sofia, what they do in Bulgaria. So like, I'm in a traffic light now to go either straight or to turn right. Now, if I turn right, if the traffic light goes green to turn right, guess what? The crossing for this, so I'm here, and then there's a crossing here, this turns green as well. So you have to wait for all the people to cross until you can go right, but both are in green. Which means that if there's a lot of people here, literally one or two cars can get through this traffic light. It's so stupid. I've only seen this system in Bulgaria, it's really weird. Anyway, uh, I'm just gonna go home. I need to edit the vlog quickly. Oh, oh well, you should have a nap or eat. I definitely need to eat something. I'm so hungry. I'm so glad I ate something before I went there as well because it was fucking unbearable. So yeah, I'll, I'll probably pick back up tomorrow. Uh, I've got a few things to sort out. Or maybe I'll end the video here. I'm not sure. We'll see later. Hi.
Alright guys, so I kind of forgot to vlog throughout today because I was busy doing check-ins. Um, I ate two Swedish uh, knäckebröd. Which are these guys. Two of these with some uh, uh, mature cheddar on there, 30 grams. Then I also ate some chicken that I cooked up with some uh, bean sprouts. And I had that with some coconut milk and Thai green curry. Um, I had a creamy in the freezer that I ate as well, which is half protein pudding. A whey, scoop of whey and egg whites. Yes, it's not for you. And then here, my last meal is uh, 200 grams of beef, ground beef with feta. Uh, my, my, my calories come down to pretty much exactly two and a half thousand. Uh, I'm not, he has uh, a lavash to go with it. I don't because I've had quite a lot of carbs already today. So yeah, or he's just gonna have a shower and then we're gonna eat. So, thank you so much for watching. Um, I'll put my macros here, my track in. Insert A. What emoji shall we do? What emoji? What emoji? Ears. Let's put in some big ears. Some big ear emojis. <laughs> yeah, put in some ear emojis if you've made it this far. If you've made it this far. And uh, I'll see you next video, guys. Bye.